Hey guys, Super Godzilla Final Wars here, and today I'm back with possibly the last profile video that I'm going to do for today. So, yeah. Anyways, we're going to be talking about Maya Apex Goji. If you don't know who she is, um, I'll leave a link in, in the description below so that way you guys can check it out to see who she is. Anyways, without further ado, let's move on. So, Maya Apex Goji, she is the third daughter of Maya Godzilla. I mean, if you don't know Godzilla. Her height, she is slightly shorter than Maya Lava Goji, about 291 meters. 0.5. So she's a bit more shorter. And her age, nine years old. Yeah, she's nine years old. And of course, I talked about her other siblings Maya Plasma Goji, the firstborn. Maya Shadow Goji, the secondborn. Maya Godzilla Jr., thirdborn. Maya Nightmare Goji, fourthborn. May Lava Goji, the fifth born, and this is the sixth born. We're gonna move on to the last two, and then and probably tomorrow, probably. Anyways, Anyways for her appearance, it is a little bit of a mix of a little bit of like. Like Shin Godzilla and mixed with the Monsterverse Godzilla and just for Godzilla combined. So, yeah. For her spines, there are GMK Godzilla and Godzilla 2018 Dwarf Spines. Those are her spines. Anyways. For her atomic breath color, it is gray with a blue ray around it. And of course, just like her other siblings, she too also has red and purple markings. Now, without further ado, let's go over her history. So... Since she's like nine years old, she's not quite ready to go out patrolling with her family. And let alone go on hunting trips with them. And of course she still has to stay like in the center of her family's nest. So that way... Nothing can, well, happen to her. She won't get hurt or get killed. And, of course, she shares a little bit in common with her mom and dad. Just a little bit with her mom, but the rest is flat out her dad. So, she does, she is kind sometimes, but not that kind. And she's highly aggressive. Just like her old man. I know what you guys might be saying. Maya Godzilla will be proud. To be honest, he actually is proud that his kids share a little bit more in common with him. But a few of them do share a lot in common with, I mean, with their mom most of the time, so that way, I mean, they can be a little bit even. Just a little. And 
And for now, she is no arch rival, by the way. She is no arch rival. And of course, she does eventually learn about the balance of nature and all that stuff. Even if she doesn't become the queen of the main monsters and queen of all Godzillas, it's important for all of Man Godzilla's children to know the balance in nature and to keep the balance going. And, oh well, of course she has no love interest, so don't expect her to get a love interest early. Especially her father and mom. They won't allow their daughter to get a love interest at that time of age. At least not early. However, she is a bit more smarter than her other siblings. She does, does plan out attacks. And she does actually go into battle with her siblings, of course. She doesn't fight them, but she does help them in their fights, especially with her parents. She's very, very intelligent when it comes to these fights. So she does have the brains in, in, her, in her family. She is a lot smarter than her siblings and plans out battle strategies. So let's say, um, like say, Mayalava Goji was battling the the Skull, Mag Skullcrow Alpha. And, of course, she has a little bit of trouble fighting in him. You could say she can basically sort of plan out like a little strategy, like to tell her sister on how she can beat Man Skull Crawler Alpha. Sometimes she also makes booby traps. Yeah, she makes like little traps and just sneaks attacks. Her, her siblings sometimes not only to play around and all that stuff, and you can't expect that from her. She is still a kid, basically. Even though her, the majority of her siblings are basically full-grown adults, and most of them have mates, and most of them already have kids, but she still acts like a kid, and. and well, obviously, she is still a kid, basically. But, you, you know what I mean. So, yeah. And finally, um, she does also like her other sister. She does roam around to get some alone time, of course. So, yeah. Anyways, that is it for Mega Apex Goji. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to have Mega Gorgia with excellence. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.